Welcome everybody, it's George Gonzalez, owner of Nightskate. Very excited today because I got my delivery of the Rosie's 1992s. I've been waiting for these skates well over six months, so finally having them in the shop is amazing. Uh, I'll jump right in. So I think Rosie's did a great job with the look of the skate. So uh, Impala kind of led the way with releasing skates that look like rollerblades through the eyes of what most of the general public think rollerblades look like that makes sense um and Rosie's like I said took their lead and released a skate very similar kind of hits all the uh hits the aesthetic right on the head I feel um other huge benefit since it is a Rosie's uh, although it is riveted right here on the bottom um if you remove those rivets carefully you they will correspond with the uh screws for the UFS sole plate that means that you could turn any of these skates, any of these colorways, into uh, UFS uh, M12, essentially. So um, one other thing to keep in mind is they are the same fit as an M12, which means that they fit small. So if you uh, are somebody that wears eight, sometimes nine, get a nine, right? Um, if you have a wider foot, upsize. So uh, just something to keep in mind. If you need to come to the shop and try them on, I have a ton right now. I am quickly running out of Malta but I do have sizes of all the other skates available uh, and ready to try on. So other than that, here's some other things uh, about the skates. So I think one thing we all can agree is that Rossi's buckle is amazing. So it takes a little while to get used to how it works just because it's different. But um, basically what it does is you adjust it on this side, you press this and you slide it up or down and then once you have that set, you never have to set it again. You simply just go over here, slide that in, push that down. So a little bit different than the traditional buckle, but I think everyone agrees that it is by far the superior buckle in the game. Okay, the skate is amazing. One thing that I did notice on some of, it looks like mainly the Maltas is there is a little bit of uh, looseness on the axle. Let me see if you can hear it. You hear that? And that is tightened all the way. So what I've done to compensate uh, for this pair is I've taken these washers right here. I don't know if you can see them there. I've taken one of those and I've put it in there and it's uh, completely, it's fixed that issue. So it doesn't, it's not gonna have, be a problem with performance at all. Um, just because of how their hardware is built, um, but it will be a little bit annoying to hear a little clanking on your brand new pair of skates. So uh, that's just one thing to caution. Um, easy fix, not gonna affect performance, but something that I did notice. All right, so let's quickly go into the wheel. It is a 76 millimeter, 82A wheel. Just perfect for what you're gonna need, or for most people are gonna need for this type of skating. Comes with a generic ABIC 5 bearing. Uh, notice that spacer in the middle. So Rossi's has, I believe it's like either five or six millimeter axles. I don't know. None of my stuff seems to fit. So keep in mind that their hardware is unique. And, uh, but you can order that from me or various other places. Also, the spacers where the wheels go are rockerable. So right now I rockered them up. All you have to do is push it out. And then flip it around. Put it back in. And now it's rockered down. Looks like about one millimeter of rocker and every single wheel is able to do that. Pretty cool feature. Inside each pair of skates, you're gonna find a white envelope. Inside of that white envelope, you'll find various hearts. This is obviously a brake. So it fits on all the 1992s. If you're gonna install this brake, you'll need to use this male piece of the axle to extend it to compensate for the extra width of the brake. It also comes with two tools for your regular maintenance and then one smaller tool that helps with some of the parts that are uh, found on the skate. Hope you all enjoyed that video. Just to wrap up, my first impressions of the 1992 are that they are an amazing skate. They hit the aesthetic right on the head and the fact that you can convert them into a UFS skate means that they are going to fly off the shelves. So shopnightskate.com. I'll talk to you guys again soon.